it's Black History Month. We supposed to be black and proud. Um, but I'm gonna be honest, like I've been feeling lately that like, I don't I don't even really wanna be black anymore. Uh <laughs> No, because black used to hold so much more merit before. You know what I'm saying? Like, we used to get scholarships, we used to get jobs. We used to scare white people in the street, you know what I'm saying? But these days, gay is the new black. You gotta be gay to get all of the above. <laughs> I was literally looking in the newspaper and it was a, uh, it was a recruitment uh, pay, uh, announcement and it was from the CIA and they were just like, the CIA were recruiting strictly from the LGBT community. And I was like, look at this. You gotta be gay to get you a child with benefits. Ain't that something? <laughs> that is ridiculous. Like now you hear about the, the Boy Scouts now, like they're considering, you know, allowing the gay Boy Scouts to come in. That'd be an interesting way to camp, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Especially if it's a camp leader. All right, guys, it's time to go camping. <laughs> Make sure you get the big, big branches, because that's how I like them. Uh... <laughs> I just can't wait to come out of the closet. I'm ready. I'm going to sit my parents down. I'm going to be like, you know what? Took a turn in my life. <laughs> Decided I'm going to date women. And it's just, <laughs> seriously. And it's just going to be like, so like, were you born this way? Like, what happened? I'm just like, well, it's a recession. <laughs> <laughs> and I need a job. <laughs> I need a job. Uh, if you can't tell by now, I have an accent. I'm from Atlanta. Um, OK, cool. And uh, <laughs> it's interesting, New York, living in New York, it always, like, it never ceases to amaze me, especially, like, riding on the trains. Because back home in Atlanta, it's, like, almost required that you get up for the elderly people. Like other people will look at you and be like, you need to get up. But here in New York, y'all don't get up for nobody. Like, <laughs> y'all don't get up for old people, crippled people. It could be a pregnant lady coming onto the train and if she not having her baby on the train, y'all like, so we not getting up. <laughs> and even then, if she is having her baby on the train, somebody gonna yell out, name your baby late, cause that's what it's making me. 